Hello, welcome to Interactive CAD. Today I'm going to be showing you how to draw a basic aerofoil in SolidWorks. Uh, so to get started, I've just opened up a blank part file. And is it, if we go to the front plane, draw a sketch. And from the origin, I'm just going to draw a horizontal line at 300. Then from there, just going to draw an arc. Oops, draw an arc. And make that radius 18. And now I'm going to use the spline tool. Click the two points and then curve it up. So I'm adjusting the curve with this point here. So if I push it down, and get it to quite a uniform curve so we'll go for something like that and now it's asking it's going nuts so if i press escape without clicking again it'll give me that uniform curve i'm after and then i'll go up to trim trim those en trim the entities and then if i go to smart dimension i'm going to make that length 305 so that's profile number one so now from the front plane, I'm going to go to features, reference and create a plane. And I'm going to set offset that 500 um, from the front plane and take that. So from there, I'm going to draw a sketch on the new plane I've just created. And I'm going to draw a line. Um, the end point of my first profile, I'm going to make the midpoint of this line. So I've kept my finger on control, click the line and the point, and then go to add relations midpoint. I'm going to make that 150. And do the same again on profile. So draw an arc, make that radius 18. Then go to spline. Then click and then same again. Just extend it a bit further, click it and trim it. But I'm going to make this length now 155. So from there, I'm just going to go to features, loft, click the first profile and the second profile, and tick it. And there you go, you have a Aerofoil geometry. Very nice and simple wing geometry. Um, and you can obviously change these profiles to change the profile of the aerofoil. I hope you found this tutorial helpful. Just a nice quick tutorial. Um, if you did, please subscribe to my channel. And thanks for watching.